Hello lovelies and welcome back to my channel. This is Intuitive Tarot with me, Mama Core. Today I'm going to be reading for the collective. This is for all star signs, all my wonderful subscribers, okay? Just to say thank you and at the end of this read or like just before the end, I'll be um, announcing who the winners are of my competition where I'll be giving away, I have plugged it in, but I'll be giving away this light box and you can have it for your own star sign they're absolutely amazing it's all like 3d i'll put like a little video up here that i've done of like a color changing but yeah you get a little remote so you can change the colors and it's called tiger Ress Designs. Um, I'll link her Etsy down below. She does absolutely amazing things on there. And for us that are into anything to do with star signs, anything to do with elephants, anything to be creative and have one of a kind things, she's a girl. She's amazing. So show her my support to her because I absolutely love her. She's amazing. So let's get started. Guided messages for the collective. Guided messages for my collective, please. I can hear somebody arguing, falling out. I'm hearing tit for tat. I'm getting a lot of fire. I can feel I'm feeling hot. Yeah, it was like once upon a time, the couple that I'm seeing was mad in love with each other. But now, the truth's come out, I've just heard. And um, I'm feeling there's somebody all up in their emotions and they're saying... spiteful things to affect you they're saying things because they're trying to get a reaction out of you but it's things that aren't true they couldn't just walk away i just heard yeah you're you're realigning your focus and you're not putting your focus on the situation because it's brought a lot of unhappiness into your life yeah, I can see that. You're maintaining your self-control. You're taking charge. You're not letting anybody see how much this is affecting you, even though it's really, really affecting you. Even though it's really getting you down behind closed doors, you're... Yeah, you're getting up in your emotions, you're being upset, you're getting frustrated. I've seen somebody like, boom, punch a door. It's like a door or a very thin wall. But I see somebody's fist go through. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this big tower moment happened. And I feel like it was publicly. Are they doing things online? Publicly? Because you're... I'm seeing this, like, masculine energy. Whether you're feminine or you are a man or you're a woman, I just see there's um somebody getting in their strength, getting in their power. Women can be strong and powerful too. But I just get this masculine energy coming in. And there's a feminine energy who's 
trying to reveal as much as she can about the masculine and publicly shame him. I'm saying him, but it obviously could be a feminine. Maybe you both work online. Yeah, maybe you both work online. Because I'm just seeing that this moment's happening and a lot of people are seeing the breakdown of this relationship and there's like one a lot of people going one way and another lot of people going another way. So it's like you're not both battling because I feel like the masculine energy just wants people to know his truth. But the feminine energy is the one that's yeah, craving, craving the attention. I just heard craving the attention. I've never done a reading like this before. So you have to bear with me, guys. You know, you know your roles more than I do. This isn't a personal. This is a general reading. Excuse me. It's just I, I see somebody going. Enough is enough. Stop this. This this public. Like, oh, he did this or she did that. They did this then. They are this way. Like, enough. Enough is enough. We need to come together. We need to talk. I just heard for the kids. For the, for, for the kids. I just heard. Sorry, guys. This is, like, all over the place. This is all over the place. But I'm, I'm getting this relationship has been all over the place place there's definitely a fire sign energy so Sagittarius Leo or Aries I'm getting that the masculine is a fire sign or he's just in that energy but I just feel like if you were to come across this masculine energy you wouldn't know that anything's wrong but when the feminine energy publicly tried to shame this masculine, he had no other option but to put his say out there. But he was still very controlled. He wasn't like shaming the feminine energy. I just feel like he has more self-control, even though he wants to be like, Bleh. they did this because he wants to get the truth out there. Yeah, I just feel like he's... More stronger. Yeah, he's not being nasty with his words. He just wants to get... Yeah. He's not showing and laying down all the upset that the feminine's brought into his life. He's not earing... The, he's not ear, earing his dirty laundry, basically. That's what, he's, that's what he's doing. He's refraining from doing that. Even if he, even though he wants to, because that's what this feminine is doing to him, he's refraining from doing it. Because he still respects her. He still loves her. Even though... Yeah, even though she's, she's hurt him. She's really hurt him. I just feel like this masculine can't believe how this feminine's treated him. And he's having to walk away. He's having to put his back to this feminine, even though he's keeping his eye on her to see what she does next, because he doesn't trust her anymore. Even though she was the only one there once upon a time supporting him and being there for him and raising him up, that role is not happening anymore. And I do feel like there's a malicious energy where the feminine energy is trying her best to turn other people against this masculine that's the energy i'm feeling this is crazy i do feel that's what um a lot of people are saying to this masculine she's crazy she's she's crazy i can't believe she said that I can't believe she said that. 
yeah there's a lot of um tit for tat slagging off i'm using the alice in wonderland oracle because they've asked me to use it i don't hardly ever use this yeah i can't even shuffle i can't even shuffle that's how all over the place this energy is guide of messages the collective who needs to hear this this isn't something that I normally do. I don't normally tell stories. I normally um, just describe what I'm being shown. It's like I get a, a film in my mind being shown or I will be shown a specific memory that relates to me so I can tell you because that's what you need to hear. But this time the story is very specific and I know this isn't going to resonate for all of you. But I feel like there's a masculine who really needs to hear that everything's going to be okay. Everything's going to be all right. Um, I don't know if you're a public figure or what, but that's what I feel like. You, you and the feminine energy that is around you are both... You both work online or there's a certain part of your job that is online. But yeah, I don't... Yeah, it's hard to tune in on. Okay, wake up, it's your moment. And I just feel like it's your moment to shine. I feel like who this masculine energy is, is gonna show their true colors. If you are online, you being yourself, people being able to tune into you and see who you are. I do feel like people are gonna see that you are undeniably being you no matter what anybody else says around you you are you people have shown up for you i feel like it's a, a period of time where people have built up like a trust like an understanding they get who you are i do feel that i really really do feel that a moment of regret there is things masculines who are tuning in all the feminines and their masculine energy i do feel like you have moments where you've done things where you do regret them you've said things maybe to this feminine that you do regret and you wish you didn't do the things you have done maybe to have this relationship have the downfall that it's had but I feel like you've tried your best to be, I don't know, the good father. To turn up for this feminine. I feel like, yes, you've tried to overcome a lot of hurdles. You tried to raise yourself up. You tried to grow as, as, as a man or a masculine in your masculine energy. Um, I just feel like it's a masculine. It could be a feminine, but I feel like it's a masculine, okay? That's what I'm feeling. This is so hard. You've overcome a lot and there's a lot of people around you that are very grateful for you but I do feel like you're holding yourself accountable for what you've done but I feel like for this feminine they're not giving you that chance I feel like there's been chances but yeah they're not giving you that chance that you deserve change in the night you have changed quickly just like I said just like I said messages for a rabbit service to, uh, to service to the animal worlds it's really mad i didn't see that as a rabbit then i saw it as a dog that's really mad it's actually um a young girl with a with a rabbit but i actually saw that as a dog first of all and then it went and changed to a rabbit maybe you have um a dog around you in particular or a rabbit you have an animal around you that is your like spirit animal that's bringing you a lot of comforts and a lot of guidance. And I feel like they're guiding you into directions. And when you're getting up in your head and you're being hard on yourself, the spirit animal's coming in to guide you and say, look, everything's going to be okay. Yes, this is a really shitty time. Yes, we're going through a lot, but you're going to be all right. You're going to be a lot. You're going to be, you're going through a lot But they're reminding you of what you've accomplished. Yeah, they're reminding you of what you've accomplished. 
because I see that you're more determined, you're more focused than ever before, and you're not letting anybody, whether it is an ex, whether it is friends, whether it is family, whether it is work colleagues, I don't feel like you're not letting anybody sway your judgment. If people aren't being there for you, if they're not supporting you, if they're not raising you up, you're not giving people the time of day that they deserve. No, 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 that's not how it works. It's not how it works. No. I'm gonna get, quickly, a message. What messages? I know it's in here. No, it's not there. Oh, there we are. It's a mask that wears glasses. You can see it. There's something here. I'm feeling it. So. <laughs> This is such a mad energy. This is such a mad energy. But I'm seeing a mask on with glasses and there's something here. Whether it's a hat or a, a like a headscarf or something. I'm seeing that you're like arranging something on your head. <laughs> um, at the days. It's definitely a lot of colour. Definitely a lot of colour. Know that you are protected as you face challenges, but remain cautious, which I feel like you're doing anyway. You're a lion. Number 16. Harness the loyal and protective aura of the lion and change ahead Magnifi magnificently. <laughs> Get your words out. <laughs> God can talk for a minute then. Yeah, there was a while where you held back communication. Number 22 on mountain. Know that you're protected. I feel like there was a while where you didn't have the choice to have your say. You weren't able to tell your side of the story and you had to quieten and wait for a period of time, go into that hermit mode, protect yourself. And I feel like most recently, your most recent past, you've come forward and you've put some light on the situation, you've havered your opinions but you've shown people your strength, your power, your determination not to give up, not to let anybody let get the better of you. You did have to go into home mode. You did have to pull your energy back for a while. But now you're turning up. You're fighting. You are strong. Enough's enough. Be in your power. Be in your strength. You've got this. Wow. I just feel how strong you are. Yeah, this has knocked you. But I just feel like you've had this like major clear out of your life. This major like understanding that even though you may love this person, even though you may want to spend the rest of your life with this person, some people aren't they just can't work out. Some people aren't just meant to be together. They, you know, have come into your life for a period of amount of time to... What is that saying? Oh, I can't remember that saying. Why people come into your life? There's a saying, literally my head's gone absolutely blank. I've said that saying so many times. People come into your life for a moment, an occasion, or something, or a lifetime. Is a saying. If you know what I'm on about, write it down below. Because that's important. And I feel like you've realised why this person came into your life now. Right. 
So the winners of the light boxes are at Trace Tarot and at Dana, D-A-N-A. -A. I'll write them both down below. B, 2017. So it's at Trace Tarot and at Dana B, 2017. So congratulations, lovelies. Um, you don't have to choose the Capricorn lighter box. I will, um, literally, you can choose your own design, what you want, and I'll obviously pay for um, whatever design you want, whatever light box you want. They do every single stuff. She does every single star sign. She will cater to what you want. She's absolutely incredible. If you did want to go and get a light box, then her Etsy store is down below for the winners who haven't won. But in April, I'll be doing another special tarot giveaway, um, which is really, really special. And I'll be letting you all know on the 1st of April what that gem is. That's a big one. Working with the same incredible, lovely lady. Um, but yeah, this is all your messages. I hope it gave you guidance on your current situation. May love and light guide you on your amazing spiritual journeys, my loves. Take care. Mm -hmm. Bye, lovelies. Bye.